this divide that we keep coming back to, I know some people like to attribute it to 2016, but it seems like it's, you know, people have been fomenting that for a while. Uh, you've spent a considerable amount of time in Washington uh, serving Illinois. Do you, do you find some starting point in your time there that kind of started this divide? Is there a focal point that you can think of? or? It's been there throughout the history of the state, and it's not uncommon. You know, you have parts of California that want to split off and be a separate state. You have a fight between New York City and the rest of the state. It's a kind of natural tension that may have been uh, created for any number of reasons, from sports rivalries to the Civil War, who knows? Mm -hmm. But shame on the politicians who try to exploit it, as far as I'm concerned. You know, that to me is uh, over the line. Uh, our job is to try to find commonality and unity and opportunities for us to work together. This is a great state. I mean, you know it because you've traveled it. But if you go from Chicago or even further north, Waukegan, Zion, and head on down to Cairo, you've just taken a big swath of America. You've gone from a great metropolis up here to cotton growing in Alexander County in southern Illinois. We've got it all. We've got a microcosm of the United States here. And I think we can make this state work if we have leaders who were dedicated to that purpose.